to go south to Ghanaians for them to vote for these fools who say they want to be president is free SHS. And a whole Aflao chief is saying that we have a school year completed by the past administration just come and open it. And then you foolishly sit at peace ever and say he should go and do it eh? because the chief is telling you that do it before this time. And these are the things I keep talking about. This man, this, this Lilliput is not smart. He's a daft, arrogant idiot. Oh, me answer. Now, I, people were saying this evening, I was watching a few people, commentaries. I was watching somebody like in Koto. I watched a few people. I watched shows. They were all saying, say, can you cook for say this to a two for? He won't. And he will never. Can you cook for say this to a, a, a crooked ticket and your friend is saying, I'm waiting for opinion. He wouldn't. He never. He would never. You know why? Because a Kufu does not respect the Voltarians. This guy is a tribal fool. Everybody knows. And if this is why, this is, this is something that is difficult for you to say. I am saying it for you to hear. Obu I'm waiting for opinion and assassin and do school park no obusa or hino no echen we were we not in this country when I'm waiting for opinion made the same statement. Did the kufuado foolishly speak like this? But I don't blame a kufuado. I don't blame this man because this man to me he's daft, he's dumb, he's, he's ignorant. We cooked this dumb ignorant to be president. I blame that idiot who was sitting in front of him. Ni pana no tine nim ne kasano. Kwa mi sefa kaya papaya wune nio. Wabet nan kind to adani jimini. This issue on at hand they were discussing is more important than anything else in our in, in our country. Yes, because we use the taxpayers' money to build the school. So as a journalist sitting in front of a president, you make him know that this is a very important issue. You let him understand this is a school that has been built, it has been fitted to be used now. You have been in government for five years, Mr. President. Why haven't you opened it? And you foolishly, smokingly, stupidly sit there and laugh about it. And you see foolish boys like you denying them sitting there and laughing because a chief was speaking for his people. 